Hello and welcome to the task video in our series about organic reactions. For this section on organic reactions, you'll definitely need a pen and paper to help you. We encourage you to draw and name every structure even if you are not asked to do this. This task relates to these sections in organic reactions. Here is your first question. Make a table to summarize the types of molecules each type of reaction needs that is saturated or unsaturated, how many reactants are needed for each reaction, and how many products are formed. Use this table as an example. Remember to keep this table because it will help you answer questions later on. Draw the product or products of this reaction. Use the number of reactants, type of reactants to guide you. Here's a hint. The reactants are unsaturated and there are two of them. Question 3 is a little more challenging. Draw and name the products formed when propanol and concentrated hydrochloric acid are mixed. Now, we'll work backwards. We'll give you the products and ask you to name or draw the reactants. Name and draw the reactant or reactants in this reaction. Look at the reaction conditions and catalyst for a hint. Let's try another task similar to the previous one. This molecule is made up of a number of smaller pieces. Draw one of the pieces or monomers that went into the chain. Here is a polymer called polylactic acid. It is an ester. Draw the monomer of this molecule. A really important skill is to be able to recognize how molecules fit into a set of reactions. Sometimes you may see them asked in the form of a flow diagram. In this flow diagram, you have to fill in the molecules represented by letters. It may look scary at first, but if you work through it in the order of the letters, it becomes much easier. Start with the cracking portion of the reaction and predict the product shown as letter A. Now that you've found out molecule A, add in the water to make the two isomers B and C. Remember that isomer C is the major product from Markovnikov's rule. This is the molecule needed to react with propanoic acid. Use a sulfuric acid catalyst to make molecule D. Let's shift our attention to the other side of this flowchart. Make sure to draw the molecules each step of the way. It is the only way to learn organic chemistry. Some sort of reaction is occurring with the ethane using sunlight. Name and draw molecule E. Now, Molecule E reacts with water and concentrated sodium hydroxide to make molecule F and sodium bromide. Name and draw molecule F. Please remember to practice the names of the molecules and the types of reactions as you go. If you haven't done so already, go back and label them. This concludes the task video about organic reactions. Thank you very much. Goodbye.